Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Today, as you might be able to tell from what's on the screen, we are going to grab some more of the pages that we can find around the world um, and see if we can discover any secrets or anything. Okay, not sure why it didn't let me jump. Um, interesting i thought the pages were the cats but no i didn't mean okay well we're petting the cats uh the camera is having a little bit of a rave moment and we're petting the cat hello cat um i would like the page okay Squib Cottage. This Ilenidic country cottage belongs to an elderly squib who chose to live in the wizarding world rather than try to integrate with muggles like some squib do. He is content to his land to farm his land non-magically and supply local hamlets with fresh fruits and vegetables, although he will accept the occasional engorgement charm on a gourd or two. Nice. So, this guy's a squib, I guess. Um, okay, I wanted to just Rebellion. check out um, if there was any treasures, you know, never say no to treasure. I guess jumping is the best course of action for this field of pumpkins. Um, a pouch. Who turned off the light? <laughs> what happened there? Chicken? Was it you? Did you turn off the light? I'll let you. Okay, you didn't need my help in getting out, it looks like. Um, I was just trying to help. Um, I thought there was more. There we go. There is something behind as well. Um, nice. Okay. Anything else for anything else? Not really. It looks like we are good. Ooh, I actually want to see his house. If he's non-magical. Okay, so he has lots of pastries. I mean, I feel like this is one of the better houses we've seen. I mean, there is no bed, but um, nice. And I can't steal anything. So there you go. You did good. Just don't put things in chests. And then I'm not going to be able to steal it. So there we go. I knew there were more pages. Uh, that we had found. Um, I think basically they get revealed as we run around and cast Revelio. Uh, also some butterflies, so let's do those as well. Hello butterflies. Take me where you need to take me. Uh, see, I always lose them, but I just use the minimap to just follow where they are. Because I just, I just don't know. Oh, there they are in front of me. Okay, I'm just going high because there are enemies and I don't want to. Oh, and there is a landing platform. Let's see where the butterflies will stop. Again, I'm just following the mini map. Um. Okay, it looks like they're stopping. There we go. We're hidden. Nice. We got a blank square frame. Okay. Um, so we've been told that we don't have enough Mallow Sweet. Uh, so I wonder if we will be Let's able to actually... Yeah, not enough mallow sweet. Okay, so Merlin, you're gonna have to figure this one out by yourself. But I mean, I'm here, so why not? Anyways, bye, bitches. Um, I'm here just for the pages. Wait, wasn't there a landing platform? There was, wasn't there? I like the landing platforms. There we go. I landed on the platform. Yay. We get XP. We're so close to leveling up. It is very 
as low like the last levels um, to level up is taking ages um, but we will deal with that because there isn't much else that we can do apart from just dealing with it okay here is the page and there is also a chest it looks like so let's Ooh, we need to hide from that chest hello chest you're mine okay and a page here for something covered in snow ah oh, chocolate frogs this is a bread packaging Likely left behind uh, by a Hogwarts student visiting Hogsmeade, these enchanted confections hop around like real frogs and each come with a collectible card featuring a famous witch or wizard. I mean, I feel like everyone uh, who likes Harry Potter and Hogwarts in general uh, knows about it. But interesting that these are red. I wonder if it's like maybe dark chocolate. Um, I'm. Why can I not go on my broom? This is me trying to get on the broom. Okay. Will I fall to my death? Okay, it's not letting me do that. Um, I might be in Hogsmeade, hence be considered a place where I can't fly. Um, so I'm just trying to go forward to get out of. I still can't. I still can't. I st whoops, I can't. Can we now? Okay, we can. Nice. Okie dokie. Well, no pages here, it looks like. Uh, didn't let me want to go further. I like this song. Uh, this is one from Prisoner of Axe. No prisoner. Um, what's it called? Hoarder the Phoenix. Pretty sure that's or like a rendition of one of those songs. Uh, okay, I see. I spy with my little eye. More field guy pages. But we need to continue casting basically radio to be able to see if we can find some. Although that one looks very far. Let's see, let's just go a little bit further and then if we don't find anything interesting, we will fast travel. Um. Ooh, have we gone in here? There is a cave that we can go into. Why not? See, this is the thing. If we fast travel all the time, we just don't get to experience some of these, like, caves and stuff. Um, so it's just nice sometimes to actually, like, expand in, like, walk around, right? And just... Ooh. Okay. So it's a puzzle. Are you giving us a hint at all? Is there... Oh, there we go. I was literally about to say. Is there anything that we can act here? Yes, there is. Nice. I've never... I didn't even know that you could do... Like, that there were caves here. Oh, I broke something. Whoopsie, my bad. Put it on my tab. I never understood when people say put it on my tab. It's like... How? What even is a tab? When are you going to pay it? Like, I don't get it. I do not get it. Um, but yeah, see? We wouldn't have found it if we had just first traveled. So, and that's the thing. I'm kind of trying to stick on the lake because I feel like we usually stick on the normal, like, land. So, I wanted to stick on the lake as it... Um, yeah, I feel like it would give us more... A uh, chance to see things that we haven't seen before. I'm pretty sure this is the island where Dumbledore gets um, 
his grave. Um, there we go. Anything around? Oh, it's just, it's just nice, you know, to just... Why did everything disappear when I casted Revelli instead of appearing? Um, it's just nice to spend... It. Also, look, it's actually not that, that far. Like, it felt like very far, did we do this one? We didn't, but we don't have enough... Mm, Marshmallow, or whatever. <laughs> I don't remember um, the name of the thing. Um, it's something like a marshmallow. Whoops. Hello, wolves. Oh, there is a chest, though. I will take the chest. I was going to say, are the wolves still following me? Yeah. I didn't think so. Wolves. Is there a landing platform or something? No, it just looks like a, a puzzle cave. Okay. Okie dokie. I will be on my way. I'm here for the page. Um, and also these, like... This in intriguing. This, as in this cave that I don't know what it is. Okay. Well, we found a page. Um, I was kind of expecting her to answer the question for a second. <laughs> I think when I took that pose, I was like, well, she didn't reply, so I'm going to keep going. Um, and I guess my brain was kind of like, is she going to say something else? I don't know. Lace doily? Not sure. The locals say that this doily was left as a tribute to a beloved house elf who dreamed one day of wearing it. Oh. That is sad. But... Oh, this? I don't know. Still. Oh, you can see they have like a little... Um, like they have a head on the gravestone as well. Um, oh, that's nice. That they made a little... Um, a little place for them. Uh, can I not climb that? Well, okay. I've definitely climbed bigger bits, but let's do this. Um, okay, there we go. There we go. Dragon eyed spectacles. I know that we need to go up to get the thing, but um, I'm just gonna fly. And I think you can really get it any other way anyways. Is there only one? Oh no, there is one over there. Is there any more? I was gonna say behind me. I think there is only three. So this one and then the other one in front should be the last ones. Let's see, this is the first one. I feel like they're quite far. They're not like difficult to reach per se, but um, yeah, that wasn't too hard. I'd agree. And also, usually there is, like, enemies everywhere. So, pretty happy with that one. I think I've seen, like, this cave entrance. As in, I've seen this um, icon and I just never figured out where to enter the cave, honestly. Um, and it looks like it's going to continue being that way. So, apologies for that. But yeah, I have no clue. Um where that cave entrance could be. Um, okay, let's see. Any, I feel like we've, um, we have like gotten quite a few on this side from like um, Feldcraft side. Um, but um, Infamous for the, we will do also Infamous Falls as well. I just want to see if we can find any um, oh, look at that. There is a page somewhere here. Come on. There we go. Um, we might have trouble for this one because um, it is quite far and you need to pass through like 
that mountain pass kind of tunnel um, to get on this other side so I can't enter while flying. Oh, this is the, yeah, I was going to say, this is the graph horn layer. So it makes sense. Um, so let me just run outside. Um, and then I'll be able to use the room. I'll collect this list wing flies. There it is. I swear there is enough space to come and mount. There we go. Okay. We need to go over there. And we can explore the seas. Uh, it'd be so cool to be fair to like fly like this, like we're on top of the sea. Um, at least I think so. I know some people like find the sea very scary. I grew up like quite near the sea, so it makes sense. Ooh, there is people. Hello, people. Okay. Hello, everybody. Uh, here. Yes. Okay. Acromantula venom. Both extremely valuable and extremely poisonous, this venom is secreted from the pincers of the carnivorous acromantula. For obvious reason, it is much easier to harvest the venom from a dead spider than a living one. Yes, we definitely know something about acromantulas, don't we? Um, okay, have we actually cleared this camp ever? It doesn't look like we have, so we could clear it out because there is a chest. I mean, I guess we don't need to clear it considering we're here. We can just steal this, so might just do that. What did we get? Scorching tool. Nice. Um, any other goodies? No. Bye. Let's see if I'm able to do this guy. No, no one out here. I love of the person right in front of him. Didn't even, wasn't even bothered. Uh, but the person quite in front of him. Instead, it was like, I should check what happened. Oh, so tired. Ah. Oh. Yeah, what a sadness. I couldn't find who attacked them. Anyways. Coast is clear, boys. There we go. Okay. It's fun. Nice and easy. I like that. They didn't even see it coming. I think there is another camp. Have we cleared? Oh, that's troll. We have... Oh, is... Do we need to defeat the troll? Or do we need to just steal the things in the troll camp? I think we're gonna need to defeat the trolls. I'm not really. Um, I was trying to see if there is a chest. It doesn't look like there is a chest. I think to this, maybe on the map it says, if we need to defeat the trolls. Okay, it just says troll there. So who knows, not a problem. Bye trolls, you leave um, to tell the tale. Uh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to follow the butterflies. Um, so let's see. Where are you taking me, butterflies? Let's see if we can actually follow you guys for once instead of just relying on the minimap. I like that they change colors. They're quite cool. I'm gonna go ahead and grab these. I love the sound that they make. I've said this many times, but still. Decorated ornamental stands. Nice. Um. Oh, I, I was like, 
that looked interesting but yeah now i remember we have oh an astronomy table have we done done that that looks far okay one second before we go i mean i think we've done it uh maybe we haven't let's see big big skeleton we've been here last time i think we also found a page over there people are fighting uh, i wasn't low enough to get the bonus oh there is a maze as well up there okay well let's start with the table before night ends knowing our meat he's likely studied here no actually knowing our meat he probably hasn't studied here because it's too far and he's scared that's my guess anyways uh, I always find that if you zoom out it's always a bit quicker to um to turn and then you can zoom in um again so that's my yes we got oh we leveled up and we got some bits in our collections i think challenges there we go exploration what did we get Ooh, we have a steroid sea case sea or cape that looks very cool actually and we got a tailored coat what is this one fashionable dress robes um I want to complete this to get like the the Quidditch Quidditch, Quidditch captain like robes basically that'll be looking cool a new broom as well how many do we need for a new broom oh only two it's just finding them oh actually we had something else over here in the field guide pages we have some gloves and if we find three more in Hogsmeade we can get Zonko's chief pranksters ensemble. Um, it'd be cool to like finish the sets, I find. Um, or I think. Uh, so that's my opinion. Some money. Where were we going? Where was the maze? Down there? Oh no. Okay. Oh, I thought I was gonna die like last episode. And I did not want to do that. Okay. Is there lore? I like the... Oh, it's over there, lore. Let's see. Let's read, actually. The teenage Artemisia played a pivotal role in Yulon's growth as a wizard, but also his descent into darkness. Each strokings of the other's disdain for their muggle parents, and as Yulon changed, so did the result of his work. The hedges he nurtured grew vic vicious and volatile. The wedding of Yunon and Artemisia was a curious affair, for Artemisia's muggle father and Yunon's muggle family were all invited. It is believed that Yunon's family would have avoided the affair altogether if not for rumors of Artemisia's considerable Jari Do Dovri? Not sure. Which, unbeknownst to them, was not a pile of gold, but a single golden medallion, bewitched with the genuine curse. Enchanted by the greed, the models agreed to attend. Ooh, what is the curse? Curse. What does the curse do? Can we solve the maze? So many questions. Okay, so. Let's go this way. Ooh, let's go into the heart of the maze. And instead I went into a dead end. That's another dead end. Here, here, hmm, interesting, interesting, okay, this is, yeah, I was gonna say, I felt like that was gonna be a dead end, um, let's see, I, I understand, oh, there we go, <laughs> We did it. We got a non-identified head item. And I just Rebellion. rolled into uh, 
into the chest. Uh, lots of lots of stuff for us to pick up here. Uh, oh, it's nifflers, and this is a shiny niffler apparently. You don't look shiny. Revelio. You look like a normal one. And there is one hidden in the ground. That's fine. We'll forgive you. We'll forgive you. Let's just grab some loot. Why not? This is normal Niffler. Again. They were, it doesn't look shiny. It looks like a normal Niffler. I mean... <sighs> Okay, let's put this one. Actually, yes, let's put that one because I'm going to place Expelliarmus with that and then we'll... Okay, shiny Niffler. Where did you go? Is this you? Okay, let's see. Everything's all right. Okay, that's not the color that was displaying on um in there, was it? It didn't look the same. Let's see. Any more shiny nifflers? I should have cast. Okay, you were very quiet. You were very You didn't even try to run. Another? Are they all shiny? What's up? Okay, well, that works. <gasps> Whoops, sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to cast Filipendia. Okay, but they look green and blue. That looked green and blue. And now it's not green and blue. Yeah, it looked exactly like that one. And this one isn't a shiny, so that makes sense. I think there is one more. I think... Yes. Okay, but it's not shiny either. That's fine then. Okay, let's finish looting this place though. Apart from the bits which are inside the ground and we can't. Ooh, what happened to my camera? I'm not sure. I am about to fall. Um, okay, I didn't, luckily. Um, okay, well... We are going to finish by actually just fast traveling uh, very quickly to Hogwarts and to our room of requirement because we need more marshmallow root or sweet or whatever it's called. Um, and also we can identify some of the gear we got. There we go. Hopefully something cool. Okay, we got something flax sweet stem. Um, okay, yeah, so. Oh, we need a venomous stem tackle. Okay, we can empty this one maybe. Whoops. Okay, two. Ah, too many things. I haven't been doing this in ages, so. Um, do we not have. Okay, one thing at a time, one thing at a time. Okay, first of all, let's put the Conjuring spell and the Disappearing spell. So we're gonna make this one disappear. Okay, I need to empty pot, perfect. And then we'll make it disappear. Now, when we conjure, I think we have got an now the ones where like multiple plants haven't we yeah so let's put maybe like a medium i don't remember how big um okay let's start with a small one because we can fill up the small one i think there is like yeah five let's do this one look it fits basically perfectly Okay. 
Okay, one second. Now that we have this one, let's see. Titany, Titany. There we go. Mallow Sweet, Mandrake, and Knockgrass. So let's do Mandrake, not uh, Mallow Sweet, I meant. Um, and then we could do a Titany, I guess. We can do a Mandrake and a knot grass perfect now that we've done that we can actually remove okay so this is a man drink so we inspect this we empty it and then we're going to remove it and this is not grass which we can inspect and empty and remove so one and two get removed nice now uh up here what do we have? Chomping cabbage and flux weed. I don't remember. Uh, which one we put? Okay, shrimp fruit. Okay, but now what we do is let's do a medium one. Maybe we'll do it over here now that we've emptied it. Uh, so, herbology, medium, and I think we have the one with three. Yes, so let's do this one. Uh, can rotate. I wanted to rotate it the other way, but that's fine. Like this, maybe? I wanted it to like touch the co two corners that it doesn't look like it's going to do. Yeah, like... Uh, hmm. It's not really uh, touching the two corners, so um, maybe we do it like this over here, ish. Uh, um, let's do that for a second because now we can plant. Change jumping copper and true I think. Okay, so let's put the cabbage here because we don't use it often, so we're not gonna need it much. This so now there is only two flux weed and venomous tentacular, which are big. Uh, so do we want more shriveling thing? Um Thunderbrew not grass is for invisibility potion. Maybe we do another mallow sweet, but I guess. Um, hmm. Mandrake. Let's do. Did we do actually a Dittany here? Let me just double check. Mandrake, Dittany. Yeah, we did do Dittany. Um,. Well, we could do another Dittany. Let's do Dittany. And then uh, we will probably destroy this one. And back and destroy it. And now instead we will put, we have a big potter plant with two spaces. There we go. We put it over here. Trying to put it next to this so that maybe we can. Can you move one bit? No, okay. We'll put it there. That's fine. And here we put three flux weed and then a stone tracker, right? Wasn't. Okay. Nice, and we do a barrel roll for some reason. That's not what I want to do. I wanted to put this one in and I think with this I'm able to just move it. Uh, yeah. Move a little bit. Come on. Not just a little bit. Okay. I okay. Like this it works. Oh, that's nice the little clouds that's very cute oh i like it 
Okay, nice. Well, now the plants are a bit better, I feel like. Um, I think we have... Uh, I mean, as we're here, uh, we could... Um, okay, let's... I took that out. Uh, so we're going to need to inspect it. Empty pot, go back. Then remove this. Can we pick this up? We can't. Um, but we don't have enough that many potions, so maybe we'll be able to do it. Uh, let's see. I, I think we bought the ones, yeah, we like. Uh, this one. We like um, more spaces. So, there we go. We can put that in so that um, we're going to be able to just have more potions brewing. Um, let's do a thunder brew. Then we can do a focus. And maybe we can do a invisibility one. Why not? Um, and actually we can probably remove these ones as well. Uh, whoops, that's not what I meant to do. I didn't mean to jump. Um, and this one. And now we can remove. What did I remove? I don't know. Maybe a... Okay. I'm trying to look just at these ones. Okay. And now we can do another mm, like tea potion station. Here. A little bit more in the center. Come on. Okay or not. It's not really in the center. But... Um, it didn't want to go in the center, so not sure if it can go in the center. And then we can put this one, then we can put this one, and then we can put this one. There we go, and this way we have this one. Nice. As we're here, let's see, is there anything fun of like the decoration we have gotten? Gothic clock looks fun. Uh, oh, we have like paintings and bits. Let's see, statues. Oh, let's put like a unicorn statue. That sounds like fun. How big is it? Oh, look at that. Nice. I like that. Um, and maybe like thirst statue whoa this is big as well maybe downstairs let's see is there like there we go like can we move it a little bit back no okay sorry there we go that's fun a little something, you know. Um, season decorations. Ooh, we still have the jack-o'-lanterns apparently to unlock. Um, I hope we didn't miss out on them. Uh, seating, furniture, rugs, wall hanging. Whoa. That looks... Oh, so big. That looks cool, though. Nice. Uh, let's see. I don't really want a house out face. That will feel a bit sad. Um, some of the crests are cool. I mean, the Hogwarts crest. We can put center crest. Let's see, center crest. Phoenix, Serpent, or Lion. I guess Lion as with Gryffindor. Oh, nice. Uh, and why not a Gryffindor banner? Where can we put it? Uh, oh, nice. 
there. Uh, maybe there. We can make it bigger. Yeah. The space is not occupied. Oh. There we go. Nice. And our plants are growing. So we can start. Let's wait for this last one. Perfect. We can start to collect them. Whoops. Oh, I can't collect the mandrake, I see. Because I'm full. Three minutes, three minutes, two minutes. That's fine. We didn't need to wait for them. It was just a nice, a nice coincidence. Actually, before... That's not, again, what I want to do. Before we go out, we need to re-put... Uh, which one? I think it's Filipendo for this one. Perfect, and then we'll just go away from that because I don't really want to have um, to be so close to getting the um, Avada Kedavra all the time. Anyways, well, um, I think we've made some nice progress. Our big chair and our small chair are still here and um, having a good time. I wish you could, like, sit on them. I mean, I guess I could jump on it, kind of, um, with the little candelabra next to it. Um, okay, we can't jump on it anymore, so uh, we'll have to to just make do with what we have. But yeah, we managed to also um, make our um, room of requirement a little bit more exciting, so that's, that's fun. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'm looking forward to see you in the next one. Bye!